Nice. What? Whoa, 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 what? Yo, I got hit too. Fuck, got hit. What? What's going on, kids and kids? We are back. You already know what I'm about to tell you guys right now. Support your boy. All right, guys. So we went ahead and we watched the 10v10 Korea versus Japan. And I got to say, there was some pretty clutch moments, man. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and let me know what was the hypest moment for you. Let's jump into it. We're watching the 10v10. I know you guys want to watch that 10v10 because I, I mean, I kind of want to watch it too. I haven't watched it. So I think this matchup, uh, I think Giovanna could actually fight this character pretty well, believe it or not. I want to say like this character beats, but it's definitely like a fight. They can fight. Oh, wow. That was pretty crazy. Nice. Cross up. Wow! Why doesn't Teresa play this character? Wow, we gotta see that again, bro. He did it off of a... Oh, he did it off of a throw. Oh, that super is definitely broken. Okay, close slash. Yo, bro, that backdash 5H. Her 5H being, what, 10 frames is actually out of this world. Okay, nice. Oh, what? Definitely was an accident, but 5K, baby. That worked? Oh, yeah, this is going to hurt. Good burst. Not to break the wall so she doesn't get meter. Now, he's definitely. this is definitely going to be even now. I don't know about that combo. I, no, actually, that was pretty good. He could slow it down a little bit. If he gets that meter, the game is... Whoa. Huh. I mean, I like that I like that decision right there because breaking the... Yeah, that was pretty good because breaking the wall right there basically would have made it... Um, basically, if you slow the game down with that lead, you're going to gradually get meter. Nice. I wonder how this matchup actually plays. I don't really see this matchup as much, but man, that 5P actually anti-air... Anti-air... Uh, Potemkin is pretty crazy. Oh, see... That's uh, that's a lot of things that I feel like people should start doing now. And this is a good example right here. Is when you have meter and you go for like a commit committal throw, you should always Roman cancel it no matter what. So I really think like um, just having the resources and always just RCing it is just super important. I feel super important. Yeah, it's just too good. Oh man, okay. Nice throw. Oh, nice just defend. Yo, is back Mega Fist bu uh, punishable if you just defend it? Oh, he did. So let me tell you what happened right here. This is pretty interesting. This is an interesting interaction right here, right? Right here. So this, believe it or not, uh, this actually winning here is... Pot is supposed to win this interaction right here because of the purple. If he would have did SPD, he would have won. But he, he matched first. Nice pressure. Oh, no, nah, that goal burst is really bad because if he starts getting his turn going, yeah, like right here, this is really, really bad for Pot. Yeah, he tried to SPD there, got frame trapped. Dude. Dude, why her crouching, why her stampede just hit crouchers like that? That's really bad for a character that don't have a lot of fast normals. Good burst. Nice yellow RC. Can't get the can't really get the punish there. This is actually really really bad. Yep. Nice. Nice backdash drift. I'm surprised he was able to get that out because backdash is not really involved like that. But that was pretty good. Okay. Nice. Oh my god. Grapplers, man. Grapplers, bro. Nice. Okay. 
Seattle's a good burst. You you don't want to really take a lot of damage against Giovanna so early. You know, yeah, like this right like, this situation right here is so bad. Because Geo can just like oppress you so so much. And you don't you don't have like the resources to kinda like fight, it's really bad. Yeah, see, he kinda just have to like do things like this. And then that was pretty smart, like to drift RC to see what he was doing. Yeah. It's crazy to think that a lot of people don't think Giovanna's a strong character. But I think she's definitely one of the strongest, uh, stronger, stronger characters on the roster. Like you have to understand, mobility and high damage put together is like very, very hard to like stop. Yeah, I think Giovanna's underrated for real. But I've been talking very highly of. Them. Now, I think this matchup, I think them summoning Chip is not a good idea in this match. That's just my personal opinion. Nice six B. Okay. Oh, he did K off a hole into that mix-up, so the person just sat there. That mix-up is like more of like if you condition the opponent not to jump. Because they decided to like just choose an option, you could definitely get hit like that. Nice J2K with the mix-up. Got the back dash. Yeah. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, maybe this was actually a good choice to do this. Fight speed with with speed is probably like a good. Ty Ty is actually Ty kind of got roll, rolled over like <laughs> Ty's not bad though. I think Ty is pretty good. Nice confirm. I'm assuming that's a burst safe route, right? It's a burst safe route, and they probably get more damage. That's what I'm assuming. If they decide to burst the first hit, they get like the the good damage, and they don't get burst into the corner. I think that's another reason why they do that combo rallies too. Nice throw. Five P at the five H, bro. What is happening? Nice jump. Nice come. That was a nice punish. Let me see what punish that was. Two K. Ah, uh, that's really good for her. Because her 2k actually hits a pretty good de distance, too. Man, Ty really know his stuff. I don't understand why people don't talk about Ty. Ty was doing a lot of work. Why is people sleeping on his character? I think this matchup is pretty hard for uh, Eno, in my opinion, man. Because uh, this character can just run at you. And, like, Eno don't have, like, that great movement, you know? She has, like, like unique movement, but the flip kick... She, you know, the flip kick, she's hovering at the flip kick, so it should be pretty annoying to, like, deal with, but I'm surprised Ty is not just doing it. Oh, if he would've did it right there. Oh, he need this. Overhead? Yes. I mean, Eno's not that great. I don't think she's bottom three, though, but she's not that great. Wow, that juggle there, huh? Caught the back dash. What was that? What was that? What was that? This might work out for for Daryl now. Nice URC. Okay. Wow. Okay. This is actually good for Daryl because Daryl has uh Dar not not Daryl uh Ty. That dash super Dar, you're crazy. You deserve all of this, Dara. Dara, crazy. So already I can just see right here, it seems like uh, it's going to be a lot of just like wake up options a lot. So this is, I guess you kind of have to do this against Edo though. Good block. Sun Dipper. See right there, you want to kind of have meter to do stuff like this. All right, here come, this is where Kai is like strong. You just do this. Wow. Nice. What? Whoa, 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 what? Yo, I got hit too. I got hit. What? Nice 5K. Okay. Nice pressure. Okay, throw. 
Oh, that was godlike. That was ridiculous. Damn, that was ridiculous. That was finesse right there. Oh my god. We know that was you on the Japan. Oh, <laughs> yo, this was ridiculous, bro. Oh, that was good. That was ridiculous. Oh my god. Oh, good 6P. That was really good. Wow, he was able to get that throw. That's crazy. But he DP anyway. Oh, he jumped back in. He trying to fight. Yo, flip. Yep. Nice 6P. That was really good. Now he's, he has a 50 meter, though. He's going to definitely choose an option on wake up. Or a crazy option. Like right there. Yep. Nice. Nice caught on the back dash. Get the safe jump. This is really good. Good yellow RC. Good back dash. Okay, I got the note. Kai still has an advantage because of the 50 meter, like right here. Yep. Oh, the go he go that's a Cali gold burst. Cali. All that for a mid, dog. Yo, he spent two. He spent a hundred meter for a mid, bro. I'm disappointed in Daro. Oh my god. Oh my god. Three charge stun edges like that. <laughs> Yo. Oh my goodness. Nice. Oh, he got baited. That was crazy. He just does what he does. But honestly, when you think about it, though, in this game... Because offense is just so, like, crazy like that, it's a good, like, short-term strategy. Yeah, they definitely play like they have nothing to lose, which is, you you give a player, if you, you give somebody, like, <laughs> a power and they have nothing to lose, it's very dangerous. It's a very dangerous thing that you will see. This is the inspirational right here, man. This is the inspiration. This is what this is what people like in fighting games. I, I, I've cracked the code now. Nice conversion. This is what people like in fighting games. I cracked the code. I cracked it. Oh, if that would have worked. If he would have did 2S, that would have been nice. Nice. Oh, you try to... Ooh, I like that. Yep. Nice damage. Can he... Oh, can I find K-Whiff? Don't whiff there? Huh. Maybe it's a big character. I know that don't work on light characters, though. Are you going to burst? Oh, that don't work. Because of the... Oh, this is bad. It's bad. Oh, it's bad. Oh, it's bad. Uh-oh. 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 Oh. Oh. No! Oh, he won. He hate winning. He hate winning, bro. Oh, my God. He hate winning, bro. Oh, he hate winning. He definitely panicked. Oh my god. There's a lot of things about this Kai I really like though. I just don't I just think the run of DP and stuff like that is crazy. But he has a lot of good stuff that I do like a lot. It just uh it's just man, my man is playing like Potemkin. Okay, what is he gonna do? He has hundred meter though, so you gotta play it slow. No, you're gonna attack. Okay, my bad. My fault. DP? Bro, my man is Ume. He ooh, he is Ume. <laughs> he just Ume now. <laughs> like I said, I think this style, if he's playing, is good. But I think once people get comfortable of like dealing with this, it's gonna fall short because uh, the way the way this is, it just has too many holes. It has too many holes in the in the in the game because you know you just run out you run out of stamina. That's it. See, so you see how he's slowing down now. Hey, he slowed down a lot. He lost a lot of damage. The moment he slows down, the more damage he loses. Good backdash. I'm surprised he chose that option, knowing that he's been really consistent. See, right there. See, right here. Look. There you go. Oh, my God. It's time to watch what is about to win Evil right here. time bro okay you got the mix oh he jabbed my man don't believe in these these mix-ups they don't exist oh my god <laughs> craziest part is throw oh my god oh my god 
Jesus Christ. Could I take on this car? I mean, what do you mean take on this car? You mean like play him? I mean, if 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 DP and run up throws the things I have to worry about, I'm not really stressed out about that. I think this car is good, but I think he's ham. I think he's too ham. I think the way he plays is good for like the first two months, but I think he's gonna fall down short, like pretty, pretty rough. I don't think it's a good long-term strategy to just run up throw, run up DP, and things like that. I don't think it's gonna last long. So I think right now it's good, but then like it's gonna fall off. But he has a lot of like good awareness that I think is really good. He has a lot of good awareness for like a lot of situations that if he changes like that way he's playing and then like keep that awareness, I think he'll be super strong. When you play him, there's only two ways you look. You look you look absolutely inspiration or you look absolutely terrible. When it works, you're an inspiration. When it doesn't work, you are a meme.